Good morning, everybody. Thank you for joining me on this episode. I want to let you guys know that this video is sponsored by Alpha ESS. I have a very, very cool uh, little generator that I need to show you guys. Actually, I shouldn't say generator. I should call it a power station because that's what it is. This is a new thing for me. I didn't realize that uh, things like this existed at, at this level. Um, but here it is. Um, I'm fixing to reveal it to you right now. This thing's pretty cool. Alright, here it is. It is a little dusty. You'll have to forgive me. I mean, I have been using it. <laughs> What's so cool about this thing, if you guys would take a look here. This is the Black B2000 by Alpha ESS or Alphaeus, however you want to say that. Um, and what it is, is it's 20% smaller volume than most other common products. It's able to drive almost all uh, energy hungry household appliances. You can even run a circular saw on this thing for crying out loud. That is pretty incredible. It has an automotive grade battery and smart management system. Higher output compared to those of the same capacity. And then a bunch of other fancy stuff in here that makes it charge faster. And you can even charge this thing with a solar panel or uh, just plug it straight in and charge it. But what's really neat about this thing is it's com a completely standalone unit. You have AC 110. You have 110 volts right here at these four plugs. So you can literally plug anything in there. Plus you've got like your normal 12 volt socket here. And then you also have places to plug in USB and USB-C. It's pretty crazy that you can have a standalone unit that runs off of a battery that will do 110 volts. Or output that just a few things about power station here under 110 volt output you get 1600 watts um, under normal just standard 12 volt DC capacity you're getting to 2203 watts charges fast the inverter that's in it is very very efficient and has a 95% depth of discharge there's tons of different uses for this station as one could imagine one that's coming to me right off the top of my head would be a camping or boating situation if you needed power for literally an entire weekend uh, while you're out camping maybe you're tent camping with family maybe you're out by yourself and you want to be able to charge your phone and maybe run some lights uh, in the evening you can do that and you can keep this thing charged during the day with a solar panel just seems like a really handy thing very handy item to have with you out on a, a camping trip as long as uh, you're willing to haul around the weight this thing is a little on the heavy side however another use that just came to mind and one that I think I would use this thing for if I had a regular uh, electric flay knife with a cord I would use this right here keep it on the boat hanging out you're fishing you need to charge your phone you can do that great um, you need to charge other things maybe you need to run some lights on the boat so on and so forth you can even use this thing to run your bait tank uh, live wells things like that if you have a standalone bait tank similar to me uh, you can plug it in and this battery will run it all day long keep your bait fresh and alive but pull back up to the dock and you've got a regular 110 volt corded fish fillet knife guess what you can plug it right into the power station and clean your mess of fish so tons of different uses for it i hope that you guys will check it out links down in the description below thank you to alpha ess for sending over the black b2000 this power station is really neat and i'm going to get a lot of great use out of it also be great in deer camp another thought that just right there deer camp take it to your deer leases use it in deer camp hunting camp whatever be great for that as well but once again links down in the description below go check it out and i hope that you guys will enjoy the rest of this video let's get to it that being said today's verse of the day comes from romans chapter 8 verse 31 and it says what shall we say about such wonderful things as these if god is for us then who can ever be against us it's amazing that nothing can separate us from from god's love so no, no matter how uh, far off the deep end you think you've gone or if you've uh, turned your back and walk, walked away and been walking away for years it's never too late there's a, nothing that you have done or said that can't be forgiven through the love of Jesus Christ and his work on the cross I would encourage you guys to read Romans it's I love Romans it's a great book back to the hog hunting video though I uh, didn't do as much filming as I wanted to because this was a, a family weekend for me it was my cousin and my uncle and my cousin brought his friend along as well 
Uh, we originally just planned on doing a bunch of dove hunting. However, there weren't a whole lot of dove flying around. I think we killed maybe three or four uh, the entire weekend. It's very uh, s slow to say the, the least. However, we made the most of it and decided to jump in a blind and shoot some pigs. Uh, I fed the roads, dropped them off in the blind, let them get set up, and I basically uh, ran to the blind, got in, pulled the camera out of my bag, and bam, there were hogs right on top of us. My cousin Jefferson shot a uh, nice pig. He ended up with the sow, and Mike ended up with his uh, very first boar. So that was really neat. Uh, he'd killed some hogs in the past, but never killed a boar with the uh, good teeth. The one that he shot actually had some pretty nice teeth. Congratulations to them, too. I'm going to let this footage roll. Um, you guys enjoy it. Head shoot him if you can, but yep. if you can't, it's all right. Y'all ready? Mm -hmm. Y'all pick, pick uh, one? Yep. Okay, I'm ready. Okay. Three, hold on. two. Okay. Hold on, hold on. Stop, okay. stop, stop, stop. Okay. The pick I was on just went behind my horse. Okay. Let me know when you're ready. You ready? Yep. Three, two, one. Good shooting, guys. <laughs> That's the way to do it right there. They got to take some delicious wild pork home to fill their freezers, and I know that they were excited about that. I was happy that I could be there and share that moment with them. If you guys are wanting to do any hunting this fall and this winter and the coming spring we have lots of availabilities this year uh, lots of openings and lots of new species we have more species now on the ranch to hunt than we ever have before in the past and i can tell you guys that we have some absolute dandy texas dolls black hawaiians Corsicans, mouflons, a lot of your sheep, uh, ton, tons of all dad, of course, as a lot of you know. Um, loads of pigs, axis, there's um, black buck and fallow, oryx. We have nil guy this year. We've got all kinds of things, and I want you guys to come out and get the full experience. You can message me on Instagram. You can leave a comment down below. I can get you guys all set up and and booked however you uh, want to put it together over email. There will also be a price list in the d description of this video down below so you guys can check that out. We provide uh, the entire thing. We provide the lodging, drinks, food, your three meals a day of course. We skin, quarter, clean your animals, put them on ice. That's all part of your daily fee. And then that also covers uh, corn for the roads. We use a road feeder a lot. Um, we put out tons and tons of corn to do some hunting. We also have lots of feeders. We can do spot and stock style, do safari style, driving around. We pretty much do it all. If it's something that you want to do for a specific exotic, let me know. Drop, like I said, leave a comment down below. Uh, get in touch with me. I'll, I'll read all the comments. And if you have any other questions at all that I haven't answered so far and that the price list won't answer, my email will be down uh, at the top of the description. So you guys can email me. Uh, jump on over on Facebook or Instagram, whatever, those links are down there too. We have a ton of fun at the ranch. I would love for you guys to make it out and come have a ton of fun with us. Like I said, I will be there. I will be your personal uh, guide and I will also film your hunt and throw it up on YouTube. It's a really uh, cool and neat way for me to uh, get to spend time with you guys, the viewers who support me and this channel and, and what I, um, I do over here. And so I really appreciate you guys coming along for the ride. I have some really big news as well that I can't wait to share. Um, I think I'm going to film a, basically a whole video on kind of what uh, Megan and I are planning on doing. As uh, many of you know, I'm recently engaged to my fiance Megan, and she's going to be bringing us some hunting content as well. Once deer season gets here, she's going to be at her deer lease quite often. And uh, she's a big rifle hunter, but I think I'm going to get her into bow hunting this year as well. So that'll be exciting. But lots of good content coming from her. And then, uh, like always, there'll be tons of stuff coming from me. And then some uh, of us together, which will be a lot of fun, I think, as well. So I'm excited for this season and uh, this season of, of life, especially. Lots of things changing for me, but you guys and this channel are not changing other than... Um, we're making an addition too, so I'm excited for that. So stick with me. Be sure that you're subscribed. Hope that you guys enjoyed this quick hog hunt. If you did, leave me a thumbs up. Y'all are amazing. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in just a few days.